Welcome to the third installment in the Gates of Hell tutorial series. In today's episode, I will be going over special units and how to properly utilize them on the battlefield. To begin, let's go over medic healing and tent use. Medics contain multiple abilities on the battlefield. The first ability they contain is the ability to heal fallen soldiers. To activate this ability, you want to left click on the soldier and then right click on the desired down soldier. As you can see, once right click is selected, the medic will begin healing the down soldier. Now that soldier can go back into battle and re-engage the enemy. Another ability the medic has is to build medic tents. In order to activate this ability, you want to left click on the medic, left click on emplacement options, and then left click on medical rally points. Once you do that, a silhouette will appear of the medic tent. You want to left click and drag up in the direction you want the tent and then let go. Once you let go, the medic will build the tent over a selected period of time. Once a medic tent is built, ally units and friendly units can go into the zone around that tent to resupply their bandages. Let's go over the radio operator. This is a special unit call-in equipped with artillery flares. By going to the left menu and switching the weapon to the artillery gun, you can aim and fire a single flare. This flare will call in an artillery strike on that location. The next special unit we will go over is the engineering truck. The engineering truck comes with an assortment of materials that are useful for the battlefield. If you press I for inventory, you can see we get 10 repair kits, a boatload of anti-tank and anti-personnel mines, Soviet shovels for building personnel trenches, a mine detector, picks axes which are for building large trenches, satchel charge, and wire cutters. It also comes with two engineers, as you can see. Field engineers are equipped with a multitude of options. You can build tank trenches, large foxholes, small foxholes, tank barriers, wire barricades, big barricades, and small barricades, or otherwise known as sandbags. By left clicking and left click drag up, you can build each of these fortifications. Officers are an excellent way to rid of blind spots on the battlefield. They have a superb field of view that allows them to spot units otherwise hidden from regular infantry. If you would like to keep a specific unit spotted, select the officer, then right click on that enemy unit. I would also recommend sending an officer to return or hold fire mode to avoid engagements or injury. Additionally, Officers have a heavy cap weight that outdoes every other unit. They are an excellent asset to utilize when capturing flags. On top of cap weight, officers lower your overall CP count. Stealth units have the unique ability to sneak through enemy lines due to a small spotting value. Scout units, on the other hand, do not have that stealth but can see much further into the battlefield and have a greater line of sight. This concludes the third installment of the Gates of Hell tutorial series. Thank you for joining me, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.